I'm Erica Kurt, and I'm president and CEO of the Small World Initiative. To me, microbiology is the exciting opportunity to explore a hidden world where there are so many discoveries yet to be made. At the Small World Initiative, we're focused on tackling one of the most pressing challenges of our time, the growing global antibiotic crisis. By exploring the untapped microbial diversity of soil and discovering new antibiotics through crowdsourcing antibiotic discovery. We are working with Dr. Slava Epstein to bring his iChip invention to the Small World Initiative classroom. My name is Slava Epstein. I'm a professor of biology at Northeastern University in Boston. The overwhelming majority of microbial cells from nature do not grow in the lab, no matter what we do. Therefore, we have to put that uh, cell, environmental occurring cell, back into natural environment in some sort of contraption that will allow chemical uh, communication with, with soil and other microorganisms, but will physically separate them so that it can be removed later on, that contraption. iChip is that array. The iChip is an incredibly simple yet powerful device used to isolate and grow soil bacteria in situ. It has led to the cultivation of 300 times more colonies than using standard laboratory techniques and allows scientists to domesticate and study microbial dark matter. One application uh, of iChip uh, did not occur to me. It occurred to Erica Kurt, who saw a possibility uh, of using iChip for educational purposes. Uh, iChip uh, may be a pretty good tool uh, in high school or teaching college uh, to teach um, uh, students uh, about the vast field called microbial dark matter. They would be themselves able to grow novel microorganism, put in petri dish, and study one or another property, inclu including uh, the search for um, uh, antimicrobial properties, uh, eventually new antibiotics. That's her idea, and uh, I was completely sold. We are on a quest to engage thousands of students and educators around the world to launch their own public health campaigns, increase scientific literacy, and join the hunt to find new antibiotics and a global effort to crowdsource antibiotic discovery. We work directly with undergraduate professors and high school teachers to implement our discovery-based program in their schools. I am Julie Davis Good. I am Associate Professor at Indiana Institute of Technology in Fort Wayne, Indiana. I am delighted to work with the Small World Initiative, which partnered with ASM to bring science, specifically antibiotic discovery, to the undergraduate curriculum. I use this novel approach in my second semester general biology course to force and invite students to discover, to unearth, literally, to analyze data, and to make conclusions about their findings early in their undergraduate career. And I am thrilled to have been brought into that group. They, they have it right. There is no question. They are making a difference. Each year, we team up with the CDC, NIH, and other partners for our Do Something About Antibiotics Challenge to encourage students to develop and launch their own public health campaigns to impact their local communities and raise awareness about and change behaviors related to superbugs and the growing global antibiotic crisis. My goal is to inspire and retain students in STEM by engaging them in the real world hunt to find antibiotic producing soil microbes to treat infectious diseases. I'm Callie Pastor. I am a current senior at Williams College. I've never really thought about antibiotics ever. I'd heard there's an antibiotic crisis going on. I didn't really know what it meant. Working at Small World Initiative showed me that I could actually reach a bigger audience than just a small town, but actually whole countries or communities. And so this whole experience was super eye-opening for me. I learned a lot more about the antibiotic crisis and what antibiotic resistance was. That's the kind of reach that makes public health really awesome and what I hope to continue to do with my work in the future. I want to help make microbiology a more diverse, welcoming, and inclusive field that helps empower those within and outside of the field with a scientific approach mindset. 
I want the next girl interested in science to not just dream about using science to save lives, but to actually dig in and help save the world, starting in the classroom. In the field of microbiology, the potential for new discoveries and sheer field of opportunity is enormous. It's very exciting.